ISTQB Foundation Level, Question 279. Consider the following acceptance criteria for a user story written from the perspective of an online store owner. Given that the user is logged in and on the home page, when the user clicks on the Add Item button, when the Create Item form should appear, and the user should be able to input a name and price for the new item. In what format is this acceptance criteria written? A. Rule oriented. B. Scenario oriented. C. Product oriented. D. Process oriented. Take a moment to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to don't miss new ISTQB questions and answers that will help you guaranteed enhancing your skills. Join us on this learning journey. If you find value in that I do and my videos help you, then you have the option to donate through the links in the video description to I can release new videos on ISTQB questions on a regular basis. Correct answer is B, according to ISTQB syllabus. This user story is written in a given when-then format, which is scenario-oriented format. All the rest of the answers are wrong. Answer A is incorrect, because the rule-oriented format includes formats like bullet point, verification lists, or tabulate forms of input-output mappings, explicitly showing the rules to be followed. Given then then is a scenario-oriented format because it describes a scenario to be verified. Answer C is incorrect, because there is no product-oriented format of acceptance criteria. Typically, we should use scenario-oriented or rule-oriented formats as acceptance criteria. Answer D is incorrect, because there is no process-oriented format of acceptance criteria. Typically, we should use scenario-oriented or rule-oriented formats as acceptance criteria. Explanation. Finally, let's look at the section 4.5.2 Acceptance Criteria in the ISTQB syllabus, where we can see that there are several ways to write acceptance criteria for a user story. The two most common formats are scenario oriented, e.g., given when then format used in BDD. This is fully consistent with the correct answer B. I think this question is not difficult for you if you watch my video channel for absolutely free, only for subscribe. You could move mountains to achieve your dream. Don't stop and never give up.